Haitian fam. What's up? Haitian business. Let's get right into it. First off, don't mind the shades. Try to shop before without it. Sun got in my eyes, I'll squeeze McGee. Ignore the shades, even if I am looking really fly. Now, uh, what can I tell you about Haitian business right now? Now, I'm not gonna go too much into details because what I'm experiencing right now, I'm still overcoming it. I'm still getting through it, right? What I may tell you now, I may find a better strategy later. So it doesn't necessarily make sense for me to go ahead and tell you some of the nuances I'm experiencing because things are dynamic, things are changing. What I can provide you is a high level summary of, of, of register. That's the biggest thing I've, I've had to uh, work with, work through, work uh, uh, and overcome is getting the information together and, and, and uh, putting together the paperwork because it's not, it's not like it is in the States where you just, it's 15 minutes, you go onto one website and you're done. It, there's a much longer process involved, which you know should be worked on hopefully you know down the road. But uh, I'm gonna provide that link below. Link below will provide that information. I mean, and I, when I say provide, I mean literally I'm providing the steps, the cost, uh, there's the statues uh, that it's critical for, for you to register because of the types of different businesses you can't register as. Really, there's two. There's the large corporation, uh, Society Onomet, and, and the Society Non Collective. And uh, I'm just going to really talk about the easier one, which is the Non Collective, which is effectively a, a group sole proprietorship. Uh, and uh, we'll, we'll go through the details. Uh, in fact, you know what? Let's do that right now. Once you click the link below, it's going to take you here. I'll be adding more stuff to it, so do save that location and share it around. Society Known Collective, pretty straightforward. It's a simple general partnership. It's a lot quicker, a lot cheaper, a lot easier to do than Society Anomé. Um, and I advise folks starting off to, uh, to, to, to um, register your business as this. There's gonna be five files in here, right? The first file was a very high level uh, summary of the type of businesses that are available to you that you can utilize uh, and register as, including not-for-profits, NGOs, and, and charities, and a bunch of other stuff. It's a great resource to kind of get your hands on on what's available to you. Uh, the very next resource is directly from the Minister of Commerce and Industry. They're the groups in charge of, of registering and uh, monitoring business. Uh, the next is really a quick start, uh, guide uh, for the SA, which we'll just kind of glance over, but it's there for you. Uh, the next is the Society Non Collective Statutes Template. Huge deal, and I'm providing that to you. And then finally is the steps, specific steps associated with setting up a society numb collective in Haiti. All these five resources put together, uh, they're not necessarily handy. Um, they're not necessarily put together in one clean spot online, but I, hopefully by putting it together here would help some folks, many folks, I hope. And we open up the legal, uh, the uh, summary document. You can kind of see what I was talking about, how you have different foundations available and the, and the benefits available uh, to each and some of the cons available to each. Uh, the particular when it comes to the sign down collective, you can see what it is effectively against a general partnership where each person is going to be expected to contribute uh, both capital, both time, both resources, both um, um, in addition to um, legal responsibility, right, which is a very big one. So if I get out of that, with the biggest benefit really being in terms of the cost. I mean, uh, an essay can run upwards of $5,000. So uh, the, the Rome Collective is a fraction of that. So definitely utilize that to your advantage. And that's what I want to go into really is a site Rome Collective. It's a uh, one-stop shop file here that allows you to basically remove the red, put in your specifics, your um, company, and, and print and go. Uh, Haiti has is a French language country that's the legal language so you may have to uh, get a translator pro tip fiverr as a translator cheap resource good luck guys all right so uh, I hope that uh, you guys had a good understanding of that process. Now, uh, just a real thing, quick thing I want to talk about, which was the Haiti Tech Summit. It was a uh, fantastic 
uh, event by other Haitian diaspora individuals like me. It's great to see that this movement isn't just me. It's just other Haitian diaspora, other folks who are as tenacious, who, uh, who see the, the opportunity in this country, and who are going at it, who are trying to do something uh, about uh, you know what's going on and, 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 and do it the right way, not just through charity, but also through enterprise to hope uh, employ and, and get things done, especially in this country where you know there is this incredible entrepreneurial spirit that just needs an opportunity to shine, to show, and and grow. And so uh, you know it, it's 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 a, a massive event that's going to occur uh, in, in the coming months here. And uh, I had the opportunity to sneak in though; I got invited uh, and and get a, a preview of uh, what's coming. And uh, you know I got some footage. I'm gonna show it off to you. Um, but I got to tell you, it, it feels great. It feels great that uh, I'm, I'm part of something that, uh, A, I'm not by myself, and B, there's just so much more going on here uh, in Port-au-Prince, in Haiti, and, uh, and I'm just happy to share it with you. So, where's my fade? There we go.